welcome to the uh, Cave of Science or sometimes the uh, Hall of History, but today it's the Den of Sports. Uh, believe it or not, track practice and all spring sports will be starting up in a week, although uh, this morning it is snowing outside. So let's get into uh, some things we need for the first week of practice. Uh, practice is going to start Tuesday, March 12th, 2.45 in the mat room. Uh, all the staff's got a faculty meeting on Monday, so it's just as easy to, for us to start on Tuesday then. You've got to have your gold card to the first practice. No card, no practice. Uh, if you've already had your physical, then this will be a pretty easy thing to take care of. Uh, plan on practice until 4.15. Uh, to be honest, it's like the first couple weeks at least will probably be inside. And uh, I doubt if we'll go to 4.15, but once we move outside, you know, just plan on that for your work schedules and so forth. Probably the <clears throat> excuse me, most important piece of equipment is going to be a good pair of shoes. Uh, especially when you're running in the hallways are pretty hard. Uh, you know, for running, training, and track, you know, the, sh the shoes are everything. So make sure you get a good pair of training shoes. Uh, spikes for meets are fine. Uh, I did send out a thing from the runnery for their uh, annual spike days. And uh, again, those would last you a fairly long time because you're only going to wear those for meet days. Make sure uh, once we get going with practice, especially after the first week or so, bring uh, inside and outside clothes, includes hat, mittens, and so forth. Uh, bring more than you think you need. If you don't need to wear it, you don't have to wear it. And it's pretty tough to put on if you don't have it. This year, we're both, both the guys and the girls are going to be in black shorts. Uh, the girls have typically gone with the black compression volleyball type shorts. Guys, this year, if you're <clears throat> if you want to get these, that is a uh, fine. This also gives you the ability, guys, if you like the uh, the longer seven inch short, feel free to get those. If you're more into the, the split distance type short, well, these might be three and a half. Feel free to get those. Just make sure they are black and they are running shorts. No night, big Nike swooshes on the side or anything. Now get the running type shorts and you should be fine. And we're going to stick with black. As uh, far as undergarments, tights, uh, compression tops, whatever, just black. These are easy to find. And then uh, we don't have any problems with uh, especially putting relays together. Another thing which would be handy, uh, bring a watch. Especially when we start getting splits in, it's easy to keep track of your own. Once we get outside, a water bottle will be handy. I don't know how soon they're going to be able to get the uh, water on out on the field. And again, with this cold weather, it could be a while. My uh, shameless plug here. Check the runnery, Mr. Taylor at the runnery, <coughs> for all your uh, shoe needs, clothing needs. He's been a great supporter of the program over the many of these last few years. So uh, feel free to, to help him out, and uh, he'll take care of you over there. Most of the team info is going to come via email, my SA Virtus account, uh, the team Facebook page, athletic.net, and Remind, which is a text messaging service. And I will uh, email the links out this weekend to everybody. Uh, winter athletes, you've got two weeks after your season concludes. Now just check in with uh, Coach Schneider, Coach Peoples, and myself. Let us know what's going on with that. And if you have any questions, don't be afraid to uh, stop and see uh, one of us. Let's see, anything else of real importance here? I think we're uh, doing pretty good there. Again, if you have any questions, you know, all three of us are in the building. Don't be afraid to stop by and see us. And uh, the, the schedule I saw earlier, there may be a couple changes. I think the big one might be the first week that meet at Coopersville might be moved to a uh, double duel later in the season. But I'll confirm that later on. All right, with that, I think we're good, and uh, hopefully we'll get some warmer weather.